previously. Hey everybody and welcome back to Terraria. And when we last left off, we were in the jungle hunting down Plantera and placing torches. And then we were getting on with some angle quests and you know, not too much is going to change. Now since I last recorded it, has been about a week. I didn't want to leave that long but I spent a long time researching and planning things to do. And I have a list here of 24... 25 different things that I can do. Now some of these are going to be ongoing such as uh, fighting Plantera for the axe, fighting Duke Fishron for the wings. Those will be things that we'll keep doing over and over and over. And there are also things that I've written down once but could technically be multiple things as in get all pets. And then there are multiple pets to get. So I think we'll begin this episode with something that's been requested since I came back and started recording. And that is, uh, since the update, the pulse bow has been changed. Now, I'm not sure whether the, it's the animation or the mechanics for it. I don't, do I have any arrows? I do. So we'll grab the pulse bow out, see if it looks any different, see if I can recognize that difference from what it used to look like, and then we'll take a look. It should be around here somewhere. Is it not in here? I could have sworn I'd... Well, it must be in my uh, chest down here then. Let's take a look inside of this. Uh, da, da, um, uh, ice shivering. Am I blind? I did get one. I remember as much. Did I... Put it somewhere that I wouldn't. I wouldn't put it in one of these. I wouldn't put it in melee. It's not a tool. Where the hell did I put the. What have I got in here? Steampunk, okay. Where would I have even put this? The only place I can think of is uh, down here. What's going on in here? Don't see it in there. Where did I put my pulse bow? Is it in my chest? My um, it's not in there. I shouldn't be showing that chest, but it's not in there. It's not in bit. It's not in that. Wow. Okay, so I can't show off the pulse bow. The one thing I was going to open up the episode with. If you know, you guys know me better than I know myself. If you know where I've put the pulse bow, let me know because I don't have a clue. I don't know where I would have put it. Have I been in it? Is it over? I'll. Ooh. First things first. Give me that and that. Another Red Admiral. They're pretty rare. Well, I've found three of them now, but. Compared to the other butterflies that I find, it's not going to go in these. It wouldn't go in my restaurant or anything like that. It has to be here somewhere. I've, maybe I've put it in the wrong chest. I don't want to spend all day looking around for something. But I will. There it is. Why would I put it up here? I don't understand. Ah, <sighs> pulse bow. Right, let's have a look. Should we find it in the dark area? Oh, that's gone. <laughs> okay, let's fire it up here. Has that changed? You can definitely see it bounces more. But it does eventually come to a standstill. You can hold it down anyway. That could possibly be okay. But I still don't think it's worth using. 
What what was it like before? I don't even remember. I do remember it kind of sucked. Ugh. I hate how there are mummies in my ocean. It's because this isn't a natural ocean biome here. Because I extended it out. The ocean biome ended about where this tower is here. And I had to... In order to build this, I had to increase the size of my beach and then fill in the ocean around it. So technically this is classed as a desert rather than a beach, which is unfortunate. I would very much like it to be a beach. Right, we're going to fly across here. I want to check if I have some of the things that I want. I do have one of them. Take that, go home. Now what we're going to do is fight whatever his face is, King Slime, and see if we can get a hold of his trophy. We may, we may not. But it is now the only trophy that we're missing, so we might as well. Now, as per usual, before I summon him, I will save my game because he's quite buggy. He likes to spawn in areas that he's not supposed to spawn in and then just glitch out the world and die. So I think if I usually stand like here to spawn him, don't I? And that can bring him in like above me or down here. Let's stand here. That seems good enough, right? Save game. Bring out King Slime. Give him a second to make sure he's fully spawned. Check the map. Is he over here? No. Is he above me? I cannot fly for the life of me. Oh, yeah, there he is. Okay, let's just, um... Should we try the flare on? Flare on? In the comments, a lot of you have been really angry with me pronouncing this incorrectly. But I, I bounce backwards and forwards between Flare On and Flare on. It's just... There's something wrong with me, I know. Right, we didn't get what we wanted. But that's fine, because all we need to do is grab up a bunch of gold, which I'm assuming we have lots of. Actually, not as much as I expected. Ooh, that's it. You look at the copper and the iron. Even tungsten we're running a bit low on. Um, copper and iron we've got tons of. We might have to go on a bit of a, a gold adventure. We need some rubies, I believe, and slime. That is what I want. Oh, you know what we've got out here, don't you? Ooh, butterflies is what we've got. Pop those away. Right, uh, in here we've got like a, just a crap ton. How much do we need? I don't know. Let's take like 3,000. Even more butterflies. What's going on? Don't get me wrong, I'm loving it. I love the fact that there are... More things for me to catch. Another Red Admiral. Right, I'm going to be careful to try not to get my people killed by Riffs. I wish there was a better way to defend against them. Unfortunately, at the moment, the only way to do that is to dig a pit for Riffs to fall into because they can't fly. They need blocks in order to fly up through them. So if you leave a pit, it works. But I don't like that because it just looks like your building is flying. What am I missing? Oh, I need to actually make the crown first. Also, it turns out I don't need anywhere near as much uh, slime as I thought I did. 30, make one, two, three. I think this is what happened to our gold last time, wasn't it? I summoned lots of king slimes. And that really ate for our gold reserves. It's okay. I was planning on doing... Maybe not a, a big mineral resource hunt, but I was planning on going digging to do something, so I'll just try and look out for gold as well, I guess. Right, over here, one, two, three. Take me back out. How's clean is my inventory? It's quite full. So we'll go put this slime away in here. At least as much, at least as, much as we can, and the butterflies can go away too. I guess I could always stick away the rubies and gold and stuff as well, since there's no point carrying those around. How many rubies do we have? Rubies are like our lowest, even lower than diamonds. That's pretty crazy to think of. Oh yeah, that, I wonder why I just dead stop there. Because I didn't activate my wall the second time when I came out of it. Right, uh, again we'll save and... Be prepared for the guy to just not show up. 
Because it happens. It has happened to us in the past. Multiple times, to be honest. Bush, bush, bush. Check the map in a second. There we go. Could be him up there. Really only one way to find out. Oh yeah, it is. Hello, let's try the flare on again. And we got like the exact same treasure as last time. Look. Ben. Right, we shall summon the next one. You're not a flare on. I mean, you're not a king slime. There he is. What's going on? There we go. <laughs> what did we even get from that? I didn't even see. A shackle. Where's the... I thought he was guaranteed to drop a piece of the ninja outfit. Oh, there it is. I... It's so... Uh, this game is so dark, I can't see what's going on. Right, next. Where are you now? That's not you down here. I can't fight for that tiny gap. King Slime? King Slime? Oh, there you are. Hello! And that does not look like we got the King Slime trophy, which is very unfortunate. Indeed, and we've just been all this crap. Yeah, that's really bad, because we're running low on the old um, gold now. I really don't want to risk... Summoning, summoning him anymore due to the fact that we may actually run out of gold and there might be something we need it for. I don't know. Right, so we'll set that to the side for now. We'll come back to the King Slime. So next on my list to do was... Ah, yes, this one. So what we'll do is, if we even have any, and I don't know if we do, we have some. I'm going to take this Chlorophyte. We're going to jump up here, and then up here again. And we're going to grab out of this chest here, our resource chest, like 460 mushrooms, and then we'll come back this way. And we're going to craft at this machine some shroomite. Now, I don't know how much I need, so let's just make 10. I can always come back and see later and we want to look at these over here if you 18 whoa okay then can I make 18 oh I can nice and how much do I have left 2500 that's fine all right let's make something you guys have been requesting again a lot of the shroomite digging claw 66 melee damage seems pretty good actually. Bonk. Right, uh, pop away some of this stuff and then we'll check out its statistics. It's vital for statistic. Wow. Come on, brain. Come on, brain. Right, so we got a demonic version of it, okay. It gives it 16% uh, damage up to 76. 5 second critical strike chance, so 27%, uh, let's, let's put it right next to this one. So, it's stronger. Same critical strike chance, but it's not even legendary or anything. Both very fast. This has a strong knockback, this has average. It serves as an axe as well as a pickaxe, that's pretty handy. Now, the differences between them is that this one can mine slightly faster, it seems, by the 210% pickaxe power. And it's also capable of mining lizard bricks, whereas this one isn't. But also, this has plus one range, this has minus one range. So we're losing two points of range for digging. So we go from... Hang on. Here, look, we can dig all the way to... Just after the golden chest lock. If we switch to this, we can only dig the first point of the chest. Hmm. Right, let's um swing them, see how fast they are. 
See, that just looks amazingly fast. That definitely seems faster. Do you ever need the extra range from this? Maybe for the let's builds? I think the Pixar is going to be relegated to let's builds and then you no know, mining lizard temples. And the Shroomite Digging Claw is going to be our regular diggery doodery for now. So let's... Actually, I'll put my Pixar in my safe. That way if I ever find out I need to dig into a lizard temple, I can just bring it back out. 